Oh, I've returned. We're playing more... Reaver Tavern Story. Yeah, it's almost up to 100 videos. Well, let me check out the story notes. Couldn't get Dante's dream, oh well. Oh, it's going to be a hot minute before that. Okay. I just wanted to be sure. We might get a few cutscenes, but not too many. Yeah, then I gotta... Start gathering more ingredients again, going off screen. So that probably means more Final Fantasy and more Mugen Souls, but I've been doing a lot more Mugen Souls, so I'll just focus on Mugen... Uh, let's just do one thing at a time. So let's just do Mugen Souls, then I'll go and do Evil Creo, then I'll do Final Fantasy, and I'll just play this game alongside this, so... It's not a big deal. Okay, yep. Stop killing Dante. You fucking not. Oh yeah, back in the old game, if I remember from Adventure Bar Story, they did not show the health bars. The only way they have the health bars is have that equip on. That was the only way you were able to see the health bars. Now they just have them on, thank god. So now you can tell, like, how much HP an enemy has before they go down. Back in Adventure Bar Story, you didn't know. So you had to keep hitting it until it fucking died. <laughs> Basically... Alright, yep. Keep grabbing water, thank you. Do, 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 do. Did 
That true, Stella. Interesting. True. <laughs> but what's wrong, Varl? Looking at young girls and laughing, it's a bit scary. Ah, oh, sorry. I just remembered my daughter. Your, your daughter? So you do have family, Varl. I have one daughter. She left home, though. She's doing well. I see. Do you never see her? No, if she's well, though, that's good enough for me. Yeah, well, what if she wants to see you? Did you ever consider her fucking feelings? You old piece of shit! Alright, let me just... Nah, don't make fun of Varl. Varl! Listen, Varl! Varl can't even fucking go see his daughter even if he wanted to. He's forced out of the fucking kingdom. He can't really go fucking see her. Oh, Lies upstairs. That's right. If you want to trigger the cutscene, he's always upstairs, so. I just forgot. Hold on. Let me trigger that cutscene now. You're working hard, Elias. Am I interrupting you? Ah, uh, Patty, no, I was just going to take a break. What are you doing today? Researching the kingdom's history. History? After all that with Bellatina, I got interested in the subhumans. Amelia and dwarves. I found out something interesting, too. Originally, the Amelia were something else. The ancestors of the humans here were a maritime people living on the coast, but slowly moved inland. It's not clear if the subhumans didn't get, all on, get on with the humans, or if the humans drove them out. But the dwarves moved to the mountains in the north, and the Amelia to the forests in the east. Hmm. The ruins at Sunny Hill are proof that there were once subhumans in the inner lands. Those ruins were made by the dwarves, and have ancient Amelia magic cast on them. That's a pretty strange combination. Dwarves and Amelia are generally thought of as enemies, but maybe they once lived peacefully together. So maybe the the day when they can live together might come again. You never know. You're right, I hope so. Good day. Ah, Patty, welcome. Hi. You're here too, Stella? What are you two doing here? Nothing special, just chatting. Yeah, Stella, just chatting, yeah? Yeah, just chatting. Yeah, idle chat. And fortune telling. 
Stella! Fortune telling, that's nice. So what's Erica's fortune, Stella? Well... <laughs> Stella! Just joking. It's a secret. Eh, secret? Secret's a secret. Your joke's gonna too far, Stella. Okay, this is what I promised you. <laughs> Looks good. <laughs> these are good, these leaves. Okay, it's a real, real secret. Don't worry. Fortune tellers keep secrets. Did I see something I shouldn't have? What are those leaves? Ah, oh, they're tea leaves. Stella asked me to get them for her. Ah, I see tea leaves. By the way, what was the fortune telling about? It's a secret. Jesus! Uh, Patty. She was asking if Dante liked her. Ooh! Okay, okay. It, it could have been that, seriously. Like, oh my fuck, get a room, you two! Just fuck already! <laughs> a few days after Bellatina's identity. Uh, Stella's dream. So that will happen at some point. So it's just these two left. Alright. So that means your boy's gotta do more, gr uh... Getting more ingredients, stuff like that. That's what I gotta do. Yeah.